Okay, so in a minute you'll see the screen capture of the output which is on the screen here. This is uh, the end of the, the capture. Uh, but just summing up, this uh, is just a quick video to show with a pre-production Rock 64, which is this output here. That was a 2 gig model, uh, which has some issues with the USB 3. Uh, this output on this side, uh, USB 1, that is a production 4 gig Rock 64 module. I will be putting up a quick unboxing video shortly too. Uh, that arrived yesterday. Um, the two units in question are these two here and unfortunately they're the other way around. The the unit with the sticker on it is the uh, production unit and this is the uh, pre-production one. The only difference between them at the moment is as you can see I have um, the two heat sinks, the this one's on the CPU, it's a 20 by 20 mil. Uh, this one's on the memory, but it's not actually needed. The memory doesn't get hot on this at all. Um, it's just that I had the heatsink handy and it fitted. And uh, this one's got the EMMC module, which is what this is the test of. So it's the pre production 2 gig that has the EMMC memory on it. And this is the production one, which is running off um, one of the. Um, Samsung uh, EVO cards, so these little fellas, just get the camera to focus. Uh, although in my case it's actually a 16, well in this case it's a 16 gig card that it's booting off. Um, they're both plugged into Ethernet, it's on a gigabit Ethernet switch. Uh, they are both being powered off um, the provided power supplies and the way that I'm doing this is uh, I just flip I shut them down, I flip the power off at the switch, I then um, connect it to the two uh, USB serial modules which you'll see at the start of the capture and then I flip the power on and you get to see how the two boards perform and I have to admit um, they're pretty close. I think you'll find out that most of the um, boot time is more CPU intensive so um, the media doesn't make that much of a difference and if you go back through some of the IR chat history I do believe that uh, Thomas Kayser actually goes into that a little bit further but um, yeah this will give you guys a bit of an idea of what the performance of this board really is like. 